Hi guys, this is a video on Windows software. I received a message from, I don't want to say I've got your name wrong before, so I'm just going to say this user here um, has sent me a message on one of my videos where it says how to have Windows Vista sounds on Windows XP. Um, basically, uh, he wants to know if he you can change your his icons on his computer. Um, now there is a piece of software called Icon Packager which um, can do this and you just load in a set and it will load it all up but there's also a freeware equivalent called icon file um, so icon file just double click it and you'll notice it comes up with a load of these I think you can drag your own custom icon sets in and obviously if he wants to if you want to vistify it you know put vista icons in you'll have to download a set I'm not sure if the Icon packages sets work with this, but if you if you search for something like icon file skins or icon file sets, icon sets, you might be able to change it to Vista. And if you don't want Vista at all, you, you then just download the bare formats of the icons. Unfortunately, I think you have to you have to do these one by one. But it also supports um, importing schemes, so yeah, you'll have to look for a scheme, Google it or something, because. <laughs> um, I had a look but there doesn't seem to be many on Vista and I managed to download one but it just had like the recycle bin and that was it so a bit pointless so it's up to you wh where you get these icons from but icon file is a freeware application to change your icons now if you really want to go all out then there is something oh sorry yeah I old good freeware icon file I'll leave the link in the description to download it uh, if you really want to go all out and getting your icons to look like Vista and pretty much everything like s things in the system tray like um, network icons and sound icons and get everything to look like Vista um, then you can get something called a Vista icon pack now Vista icon pack was made quite a while ago um, there was a version 2.1 which was a patcher and then they came out with ver version 3 which just contained icons that's for developers. I mean, uh, you might be able to download uh, version 3, the developer's edition, to import icons into this. So you can do it manually. Or if you want to patch the whole lot, um, a guy on jojo.org has managed to find a download link for the actual patcher, which will patch your system. And uh, it was only, it was done just last month. So. Um, you can download it, I'll provide the link in the description and basically you can patch your whole thing to look like Vista I'll just show you how it works, you can extract it um, I've just downloaded it so you just double click uh, Vista icon pack double click Vista icon pack, system patch, next I accept, next, I'm not actually going to apply it I'll just show you what the options are so patch windows and applications and install additional um, we just want to, well, we'll just, it says Vista Icon Pack version 3 main icon patch, patch log on screen, no, boot screens, no, patch Internet Explorer icons version 6 only, yes, patch Windows Media Player icons of bitmaps, no, uh, I'll just turn it off, and install Vista mouse cursor, so you can also do your mouse cursor with this if you really want to, and auto update, no, nah. Vista Drive Bar status where um, you go into my computer. I don't know if you've seen on Vista, um, instead of dragging your mouse over and showing the free space, it's got a little bar that shows you how, how much free space you've got. So if you really want to make your computer look like Vista, then try this out. And Vista Tooltip, which is when you hold your mouse over here, um, it shows a um, box which has got a preview of what you've, you're looking at. Um, I think your window actually has to be open to do that, as it does in Vista. So if you have it like that, and have it in the background, then you can hang it over here and it will have a box here that previews it. So that's about it really. I can't really test anything else apart from using icon file to edit your um, icons if you want to go through them one by one. There's loads here. And then you can add your own sets or download the um, the packs that you can get that are for icon file. But this, this doesn't seem to be very well known. People usually say just download icon packager, but as I said, it's not free. So this is the freeware equi equivalent. So that's about it really, so icon file and the Vista icon pack version 3 system patch. So thanks for watching my video, I hope this has answered your question to the best that I can. Um, if there's anything better that you know of, um, people will probably say download icon packager over torrents or P2P, but we've got to try and keep things legal people. So um, thanks for watching my video, please rate and comment, like, uh, t I'm not going to try and say his name. Um, 
thanks uh, again and yeah please rate comment and subscribe